All right, folks, dust off those blankets and grab your basket because the summer picnic season is upon us. Why not find a shady spot in the park or even your own backyard and enjoy dinner al fresco? So joining me in the kitchen is celebrity chef Mark Kalix to share some picnic perfect recipes. I love having you in. Thank you. And really tell us when you're when you're trying to arrange a picnic, yeah. should you do just kind of like easy, fast and fresh kind of finger foods, or can you really go all out? You can go all out with a little bit of just prep, some thought, Okay. walk around the grocery store, find what's fresh, and of course, utilize what is this, what's seasonal. Right, you know? definitely. And, and what I love is panzanella salad. You're gonna it see- It looks beautiful. Yeah, we've got some, some grilled vegetables here, zucchini, squash, onions, and peppers. Mm -hmm. And when you're grilling zucchini, it's really important to get rid of the seeds. So let me show you a little yeah. knife trick here. All right, I love the right. pro tips. Yeah, so uh, if you take out the outside, grill this part, this is where all the flavor is. Ah, and, and this, take out the seeds. This is all water. You know, you ever like, Saute zucchini, it gets yes. like a like a mess. Yes. Get rid of that. Smart. Grill this, and you're gonna have a vegetable that really holds up quite nicely. So perfect. And then don't cut your vegetables too small. You don't want them to fall through the through the grill grates. So okay. I just take out the seeds in one shot. You make it look so easy. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Little practice I've been there. I can at that thing for like five minutes. <laughs> but look how easy that's gonna handle on your it's grill. It's beautiful. Oh yeah. my gosh. So we've got our vegetables here, and you know I toasted off a bunch of uh, uh, Italian bread. Beautiful. So, you know what I love about this salad, this panzanella salad, uh -huh. is that it, it will hold up in the refrigerator. So you can make this the day before, and I promise you this won't get mushy. Okay. No one wants mushy bread. No. No, never, You're never. You're just mixing that all in with the peppers and zucchini yep. and onion, and then you have some beautiful roasted lemons. Yeah, those one on the grill too. I march them across uh, the grill. They look great. I just think they add a ton of flavor, but you know how like, sometimes lemon can be too much? Right. You know, it's like, oh gosh, lemon and everything. But the heat changes some of the, the sugars in it, right? It does, it oh. does. It mellows stuff Love out. It. All right, so there's one. It's beautiful. And you can make this beforehand. Yeah, you're gonna taste? Well, yeah, yeah. I, I should. Right. I also probably have to talk, so I'll take a, a little tiny it's, TV bite. Yeah, take a TV bite. Let me know what you think. <laughs> Let me know what you think mm. of the grilled lemon. I love it. You love it? So good. Okay. You can taste that char from the grill mm -hmm. and just a little bit of that spice, you know, flavor from the lemon. That's but, right. um, and you recommend this is fine to serve cold. It doesn't it have to be hot. You can right? do it hot or cold. Okay. I make it in advance and I bring it along. But let's say you want to do a little cooking when okay. you're doing your picnic. So I'd make these kits all the time. This is a. Um, a kind of, um, our mozzarella and our tomato. Yeah, caprese, like a caprese, caprese yeah. salad. I wrap up my basil in a little, you know, a little towel here. It's good to tear your basil so you don't bruise it. And then yep. to dress it, I make my dressing in a throw it in a squeeze bottle. Love here, it. Here's the pro tip: a little plastic wrap to keep it leaking. Yep. All right. Don't want that to leak in your don't, picnic basket. Uh, so balsamic. Perfect. Olive oil, clove of garlic in there. Do you have a pro tip for picking and storing <laughs> tomatoes the best way to get the freshest and best tomatoes? Just don't refrigerate them. Oh, you know, that's right. really, once they hit the refrigerator, they're gonna lose their, their wholesomeness and they just don't mm -hmm. have the same flavor. So there we go. I'm gonna taste this myself. Yeah, dive in. And I love this Here. because we have, we have tomatoes, we have basil. Everybody I know loves a caprese salad. No man, woman, or child has ever said to me, no thanks, no Chef Mark, Fresh I don't want caprese. Basil, so good. Okay, before we run out of time, mm -hmm. let's talk about watermelon. Yes. You know, watermelon mm. is such a delicious treat, particularly this time of year. And I do a watermelon salad. This is something that I just really enjoy. You can serve it as a, um, as a salad. So what do you got? You know, I had some scallions kicking around. I love feta because it's salty. I love olives because it's briny. The salty and the sweet that's, together. That's right. And then um, onions. I love to marinate my onions in some cold water overnight so that they offer a nice uh, bite without like making your eyes water. That's another pro tip. <laughs> marinate them in cold water. I love it. That's right. And then finally, of course, the food of my people, Kalamata <laughs> olives. I love it. I love it. Can never get enough olives. That's right. And you know, maybe some extra virgin olive oil, some lemon juice. Maybe right. you got your dressing kicking around. It just is a feast for the eyes and it's delicious. Love it. And any, you know, pro tip for pairing with an entree, does it really not matter? You can do anything with a salad. Yeah, so, um, you know, I'm gonna be grilling some proteins yep. and bringing those already grilled, already sliced. Smart. 
um, and have everything packaged. And then don't forget your your plates, your silverware. Yep. Don't right. forget your trash bowl. Well, we got to go, Chef. Thank you so much. That was so wonderful. Chef Mark Kalix is the celebrity chef for Appliance Factory Fine Lines. If you'd like to book Chef Mark for an in-home cooking class or dinner party, you can find more information on his website at celebritychefmarkk.com. That's going to do it for us today. Thanks for joining us, and we'll see you back here tomorrow at 1130 a.m.